bit of a different video today to say the least. The one thing I want to make clear here, I'm not going to defend the actual act of defecating on a beach in public. Obviously, you can't do that. No matter what the circumstances are, you got to figure it out. You got to be like an adult, just a functioning human being. You got to figure it out. But I am going to seek to try to explain perhaps why this is happening or allegedly happening at least. There's a controversy online over people defecating in public in Canada and specifically in the largest province of Ontario. There needs to be a ban. There needs to be a ban. If people can't take care of themselves, then this is a bathroom right here, my friend. Just go poop in the bathroom. You know what I mean? <laughs> Simple as that. Other business owners along Beach Drive told CTV News that there aren't enough public washrooms to meet the demands of the beach's large crowds on weekends. Shocking to see that on the news as that was one of Canada's largest news stations, CTV, covering this alleged problem in one specific area of Ontario. However, there has been reports at least of this potentially happening in other areas of Ontario. Harry Harrison Faulkner tweeted, Brampton man, just couldn't walk the extra 15 yards to the bathroom. The tweet she's referring to there also had a photo accompanying it, which I'm not going to show on screen because it's gross. But as this controversy has swirled online, people saying, oh, some of these are AI, some of these aren't real, or people showing other photos of this allegedly happening in other, in other areas of Ontario. This even got up to the Ontario Premier, Doug Ford, as he addressed this in a recent press conference. I, I think people are respectful enough that folks don't be pooping on the beach simple as that man uh, we have no proof of it either in this social media they get rolling on the social media and now to the bold part of this video where i'm going to try and explain perhaps why this is happening this is probably going to offend some people but of all the canadian provinces and i've been to most of them ontario in this one way is by far the worst in terms of the hospitality granted to a stranger entering a store and of course there are many exceptions to this if you're a stranger and you enter a store in ontario in my view, you get the worst experience. You're not technically, technically a customer yet, but you get the worst experience of any other province. In Quebec, generally you get more help. In the Prairie provinces, you definitely get a lot more help. In Ontario, it's not really like that. And I could see this being a problem if you actually need to go to the washroom and you're in Ontario. And by the way, in my personal experience, this happened to me multiple times actually. Meaning, being out in public, somewhere in Ontario, not having a car, a lot of people in Ontario don't even have cars, but you're out in public, you need to go to the washroom, and you start going into businesses and asking them, hey, can I use your washroom? They just say no. You go to another one, no, you can't use it. It's for employees only or something. That problem, I've never had that issue at all in any other province. Pre-pandemic, during the pandemic, which I can understand during the pandemic itself, but even, even as the pandemic started to go away, if you need to use the washroom and you're in Ontario, it's actually difficult. It's ridiculous. You wouldn't think probably that this would be an issue, but they actually had to pass a law in Ontario to combat this for delivery workers. The Ontario government will be introducing legislation that will allow delivery workers to access bathrooms at businesses where they are delivering or picking up items. This law will be the first of its kind in North America. Even still, if it's difficult at times to find a washroom in Ontario, you can't defecate publicly like on a beach or something like that. It's so disgusting, you have to be a functioning human being and figure it out. But I wanted to make this video because I saw some people online blaming immigrants for this. And to be clear, there's still some confusion as to whether or not this is actually a problem that's happening or just something that was kind of manufactured from social media. But I wanted to make this video still because I think Ontario, just to be blunt about it, has an issue with letting people use the washroom. I've never had that experience in any other province and especially like in the Prairie provinces, this is not a problem at all. And in Ontario, I don't know what the problem is, but in terms of the hospitality of a stranger just entering a business, it shouldn't be so difficult. Like even the fact in Ontario, they had to make a law for a delivery worker to be able to use the washroom at a place where he's making delivery highlights some type of problem. And look, everything I've said in this video really is all speculation because if you interviewed one of these people that publicly defecated on a beach, it's so disgusting. If you interviewed one of them, which I'm sure they would not agree to be interviewed, but if you asked them, hey, did you even try to go anywhere? Did you try to go to that business down the street there? Maybe they just say, no, I just did it anyway. So I don't know, but I wanted this video, as I said, because I saw people online kind of all going at it from one angle. I at least want to explain it from perhaps another angle. But with that said, if you live in Ontario, if you live anywhere in Canada, whatever the circumstances, do not publicly defecate. It's disgusting. And with that said, thank you for watching this video. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Have a good day.